Hello, it's Karen here, Kazina, and um, this is a short little video. Um, I, I just picked up a few bits the other day, and um, the question is, <laughs> what do you do when you have £6.98 in your bank account <laughs> and you're a gaming addict? Um, honestly, I, I say to myself, you know, no more games. You know, you've got more than enough to keep you busy for years, really. Um, but, you know, the person that I am, I can't help myself. Um, anyway, I was in Sutton the other day and I toodled into cash converters and I knew I didn't have any money. I I'd, I'd checked my account and it informed me I had £6.98. And um, so what do you do when you've only got that? Well, I managed to um, <laughs> pick up four items. Um, so I was very pleased with myself. And um, so this is what Karen did. Instead of going buying bread and milk, thank God I had cat food for the moggies. Always got them sorted. But um, instead of going to staple things like bread and milk, uh, I, um <laughs> I, I bought some stuff. Um, but I'm very pleased with the few bits I bought, my big six, I actually spent £6.50 and the first game I picked up, and I, uh, my last video I actually mentioned it because when I was in cash converters I didn't have much money on me again and um, I did ponder about picking this up and I think it was um, Tiger Bygan. I hope I've pronounced that right, but he, um, he, uh, sorry, my cat's just made me jump. <laughs> uh, he, he said, you know, if you can, pick it up because it's a great game. And as I said, I went in cash converters and lo and behold, they still had the game. So I'm absolutely delighted. I picked up for the Sega Saturn Manx TT super bike and i actually got out my sega saturn yesterday which has not been played for quite a long time and it was a bit stuttery um you know i think maybe the lens maybe needs a bit of a clean but i i was having a go at daytona which i i picked up la, uh, the other week and um having a go at this and he's dead right this is a really good game I, I mean i've always said i'm not very good at bike games but um this is kind of like outrun but on a bike you've got all these sort of time trials and um i've only played it for about i say about 45 minutes and um i only did the first couple of um uh tracks but it's really really enjoyable and I paid two ninety nine for this, and um, I'm really glad I listened, and I and I'm really glad it was still there. So I picked up Manx TT Superbike, and um, also I wonder if anyone's got any suggestions. Um, cash converters do this really stupid thing where they stick the sticker onto the the actual uh, cardboard, um, and I took the one off my Daytona game the other day, and it kind of ripped it, which was like uh, um but i don't want to rip this because the case is actually in quite nice condition um so any suggestions do i just use a kettle to steam it off or do i wet it or what um so i'd really appreciate any suggestions because i don't want to ruin this cover because it's 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 in as i said it's in quite nice nick um the other game i picked up and it's for the N64. I also got my N64 out last night as well and had a little blast on that. And I picked up F F1 Grand Prix and um, I had a go at this. Um, it was all right. I was a bit slidey all over the place. Uh, I paid two pounds for this, by the way. Sliding all over the shop, to be honest. Um, and um, I did play it for a little bit and then I ended up um, putting it away and having a go at Mario Tennis but um, that kind of kept me going for about an hour and a half um, but I digress so that's what I picked up as well at Cash Converters and um, I also picked up this game now I never pick up this sort of game I, I picked up one once um, because it was 50p and on the Dreamcast in a charity shop but I, I don't go out of my way to buy these sort of games and I did have a choice of some PlayStation 1 games and I picked up Fisherman's Bait 
three and it cost me a pound and why did I pick it up you ask um, do you know what um, firstly I like the cover secondly it's by Konami and third when I read the back it said that not only can you just fish you can catch mystical fish and magic monster fish and I thought cool I like the sound of that and um, I kind of I think I saw myself as something like the legend of the river king you know um, it doesn't play with that at all and um, basically it's just a water and a, and a rod and you just fish and the fish go by and um, I try and catch them and they always get away um, so far anyway I've not done very well but um, I, I just thought I'd give it a go um, not sure what I think about fishing on <laughs> on, it, as it, in, on a gaming platform but um, I thought I'd give it a go so that's what I picked up and lastly for 50p I found this lovely big sticker over it but it's an 8 um, megabyte memory card for the PS2 a silver one and um, I, I always if I see these going cheap I always pick them up because I, I've got um, two at the moment a 16 megabyte one and an 8 one that are completely full I've got one that's nearly full I think I've got a couple of spare ones and um, so um, it's always great for me to pick up these because I really have such an extensive PS2 collection so um, that's about the size of it really not very much else to say um, just wanted to share with you what I, I picked up for £6.50 when I had uh, £6.98 in the bank and uh, thankfully cash converters let you pay with your card um, I, I did go into another cash convertery type shop before and toodled up all happy and um, they said we don't take cards and luckily I had enough in change to pay for the game um, that was a, a couple of weeks ago when I picked up Resident Evil 4 on the Wii so um, anyway that's about it um, I will probably be doing another pickups video maybe in a week's time I've actually picked up some PS2 games I don't want to talk about the 49p game station saga at the moment it's depressed me because everyone's doing some great videos on how they've picked up all these games and I've had like no luck whatsoever um, in fact my local game station had none for 49p not any nada zip zoo so i'm a bit miserable about that i'm actually thinking about going further further afield here's my little friend here now i'm just going to sign off now but thanks very much for watching it's goodbye from him and it's goodbye from me